Hi, this video only contains the story, but if you would like to view the welcome or this month's theme, Samuel, or last month's theme, Noah, click on one of the links below. The title of our story is A Brave Boy. The memory verse is, I come to you in the name of the Lord. 1 Samuel 17, verse 45. David was a shepherd boy. That means he took care of sheep. David also played his harp and sung songs about Jesus. One day, or one time, a lion tried to hurt David's sheep. Another time, a bear tried to get him. David killed both of them. Jesus helped David save the sheep. David's big brothers were soldiers. Mean people were trying to hurt David's country. So the soldiers had to go fight. David wanted to help, but he had to take care of the sheep. David, please take food to your brothers, David's daddy said. So he did. David talked to his brothers. Suddenly, a loud voice started shouting. It was a huge giant. Can you beat your chest like a giant? Rawr, rawr. He was big and mean. The giant name was Goliath. Send someone to fight me. He said in his big, mean voice, Are you afraid? Goliath shouted. The soldiers were afraid. They were so afraid, they ran away. Run, 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 run as fast as you can. Run, run, run. But then David said, I'll go fight the giant. Jesus will help me. David was not a soldier. All he had was a sling, but he was not afraid. David carefully picked five smooth stones from a little stream. Can you count to five? One, two, three, four, five. That's how many stones David picked. Then he hurried to meet Goliath. Goliath was watching. He was like, who is this little boy? He couldn't believe how young David was or that David only had a sling. All the soldiers were watching too. David put a stone in his sling. He swung it around and around and around, and then zing, the stone flew as fast and hit Goliath in the head. The great big giant fell down. Who helped David fight the giant? Jesus did, and he will help us too. Happy said. Hi, this is my friend, Daddy Bear. Say hi, Daddy Bear. Have you ever seen a bear in the zoo? Bears come in different colors. Some bears are white, like polar bears. Some bears are black, like black bears. And some browns of bears are brown, like the one that tried to hurt David's sheep. In the story. The grizzly bear is one kind of brown bear. Grizzly bears are very big and strong. They can run 
very fast. Grizzly bears like to live by themselves. Sometimes they live in a forest. Sometimes they live in a meadow. And sometimes they live way up north where it's very cold. In the winter, grizzly bears can't find much food. They, to get ready for the winter, they eat a lot in the summertime. Grizzly bears eat berries and leaves and nuts. They also like to go fishing for salmon. Grizzly bears sleep a lot in the winter. Mommy grizzlies are even asleep when their cubs are born. Grizzly cubs are born without hair or teeth. Although they can't see when they're born, they nestle up to their sleeping mommy and snuggle in for the rest of the winter. By the time spring comes, the cubs have hair and their eyes are open. Then they are cute and playful. When the mommy cub wakes up, she watches over her cubs. Jesus made the grizzlies brave and strong so they can take care of their babies. Jesus will help you to be brave and strong too.